Yo, awesome guys, welcome back to E Reaction. Today's video got Juice World and Justin Bieber, Wonder to the LA official trailer. And yeah, guys, at the time of recording this year is actually Juice World's birthday, and he would have been 23 today. So happy birthday, Juice. And yeah, man, wish you were still here. And yeah, man, rest in peace to a goat, man. Like, his music just touched so many people. Like, the topics he'd speak about, just like depression, etc. And just people just wouldn't really want to speak on it. So he did. Um, for us and just yeah he's just literally changed the world for so many people and yeah man it's just it's sad and obviously we've got this album coming up now and then the documentary and I think there is a new documentary um, trailer so we're going to react to that in this um, video and yeah normally they, last year they dropped the song on Juice's birthday and yeah I think they are um, tonight um, they're dropping this song here with Justin, um, Juice Will and Justin Bieber which I didn't even know um, they had the song that was going to be if, I don't know if they had an official song together where they just obviously took a verse from Juice's or, or Juice of the song and then just added Bieber to it but um, yeah I'm super happy um, we got this as a great collab and yeah I can't wait to hear the um, official song there's so much music dropping um, tonight we've got obviously Polo's uh, two, um, Hall of Fame 2.0 Deluxe um, we've got a new Juice song now and I believe um, young boy might be dropping as well, so it's like so much music. But yeah, we're gonna watch this trailer. So this, and I was like, I gotta do a video and react to this. So yeah, let's get straight into it. See what this is. Alrighty, man. Facts. You have power of depression. Like, you spoke on this so much. Like, yeah, man. Let's just. You feel like you got anxiety. You know, you got depression. They don't look at you like you're crazy. That's not facts. Like, he just said, like, you say you got depression, as like people think you are crazy. So, like, people just don't speak on it. They just think, like, yeah, they would look at you crazy. So, people would just be high enough, but it's um, okay to have and express it. You got depression. They don't look at you like you're crazy. That's not how it should be, and that needs to change. I was waking up in the morning, and the first thing I was doing is popping pills and smoking a joint. And so sure they got Justin Bieber here talking. Let's go back. In the morning, and the first thing I was doing is popping pills and smoking a joint and starting my day. My security and stuff were coming into the. He just said that Bieber like starting his day popping pills and like smoking a blunt and yeah, man. Let's just see what else he got to say. Security and stuff were coming into the room at night to check my pulse. Like, people don't know how serious it got. I wanted to have yeah, he just said, be there and saying, like, he's been, um, hopefully he's doing good now, but he just said, like, um, insecurities and just people don't understand how bad it is or how bad it got. He was basically saying he got it under control. I don't know if he really knew it, how serious. It was. He'd lock himself in his room, and it's because he would be withdrawing from from the usage. I just would encourage people, like, hey, if you're feeling lonely, talk about it. Man, I just leave that and like, if you're lonely, just talk about it. And I think that's what um, Juice did so well. Like, he feel like he could express the music, and then a lot of us fans could like relate. It's just, yeah, man, Juice is a goat, man. Rest in peace to the goat. Only talk about it. Reminiscing about the days you broke my heart. Say it out loud. There's a freedom in that. We come so far. Stay, you gotta give me space and let me breathe. A week before he passed. You know, like in the background, like obviously, um, B was singing Juice, like obviously it's gonna be um, the song. And yeah, guys, I'll definitely be wrapped into that when that drops tonight. It's cool to the sound, like. We gotta start coming around, more. I miss how it was in the beginning, man. That shit was so much fun. He was already checked into rehab. He was already scheduled to go. Yeah, we already had him signed up. Oh, man, just, like, he, like when this documentary comes out, guys, like, it's gonna be tough to watch, man. But, like, Debbie said then, he was all scheduled for rehab and everything, and, like, just what happened, man. It's just unfortunate, man, and so sad scheduled to go yeah we already had him signed up for rehab he already agreed to go need some company. one of the last conversations we had he said he was gonna go to rehab I wanted to oh, man, like ugh, this is making me feel something like 
already like we like we knew this like they said previously like it's good for you i'm just saying her again and like just baby and i think that was his mum just talking about her saying like it's just i don't know man it's making me feel type of way it's just sad to rehab they showed them there like obviously the freestyle king as well let's not forget that I'm not the only one going through what's happening. Me talking about certain things could help somebody else do what they're going through. Facts, as I said, like, he just said he's not the only one going through things, so him speaking his music, that's why people love him, because, like, it's just so relatable, and he wasn't scared to express it and just, yeah, man. Yeah, but it's coming out tonight, the 3rd, the 12th, and then obviously it's coming out the um, 10th, so, yeah, man. Like, indeed, it's, it's this would be amazing to go to, so, if you're in the US, Chicago, there you is, join Juice World Day, 12th and 9th, 90 cent, Chicago, yeah, man. And yeah, guys, I'm super excited for this song to drop and the album documentary. And yeah, I think it was a um, new trailer for the documentary or something. So I'm going to quickly go check this out. Hey guys, this one was um, uploaded today. Juice World Into the Abyss official trailer by HBO. So yeah, I don't think, because they have done trailers already for this. But I don't think this must be a new one that's uploaded there um, today. So let's go check this out as well. Man, like, look at the crowd, like. I remember the first time seeing his name up there with Dre, Juice, Taylor Swift in that top five in the world. Juice wasn't trying. Is that say like top five in the world with like Drake and stuff like, um, crazy. Bro, Juice wasn't trying to be that. Juice just became that. He's making good music. Yeah, that's, I'm saying then um, he wasn't even trying to be like. One of the times he just liked doing music and it was like people just liked it and then he just grown so quick. Making good music. When you a fan of this shit, you look at it from a certain perspective, but then when you in it, you see it for what it really is. I'm still happy I get to change the world, but it's not what it looked like. He was so good at articulating his feelings. We ain't realized that's the way he feeling because it's turned into so much beautiful art. It was hard to separate the two. Well, that's true, man. Like, um, obviously, like his music would just be like so good, like the beats or just like the vibe of it. But like, if you actually pay attention to what he's saying, like that's how he's really feeling. And some of the stuff he'd be saying is just crazy. So that's what I mean. Like, his music is out, but if you listen to the lyrics as well, it's just how he's feeling it's actually mad hard to separate the two Facts. you know you tell you whoever that you feel like you got anxiety you feel like you got depression they don't look at you like you're crazy that's not how it should be that's how it is and that needs to change and Facts. hopefully i'm one of those people that could bring that change yes sir you definitely brought that change man definitely changed the world for sure that change Sometimes the shit gets overwhelming, but this is what I ask for. I say certain things so I could have conversations with my friends. If people get it and it relates to their life, then it's meant for them to get that shit. Juice was see, a therapist. For just seeing him on the stage, man, it's just crazy. Just having a sick time. He really did love this. And, like, he loved his family, so. Juice was a therapist for millions of kids. A voice of that. And, like, they're just saying, like, therapist, like, so true man like I'm, I'm excited for this documentary and obviously the album but it's gonna be sad too at the same time a voice of that generation i want to say thank you and i love you to all my supporters out there this is your world you can do whatever you want to do yes guys um just filled into the abyss official trailer coming out the 16th as well so yeah 
big month for um juice the stuff going on and yeah guys let me in the comments down below um are you excited for the album and documentary you know a lot of you guys are and yeah man just obviously happy birthday juice um and yeah rest in peace to the goat man and yeah guys let me know your thoughts in the comments down below please let it be already subscribe you know thanks for watching and bye for now